What's up travelers, in this video we're in Florence, Italy and today I wanted to show you something other than Italian food. We are at a place called the 1950 American Diner. That's right, burgers and burritos and all that kind of good stuff. Hey, what's up travelers? This is Gary Holt from Exodus and formerly from Slayer and I'm here to tell you to smash that subscribe button for Tasting Travel. Slayer, do it now, Tasting Travel. Check it out later. Subscribe. All the best. Bye-bye. We are at a place called the 1950 American Diner. That's right, burgers and burritos and all that kind of good stuff. And it's a pretty cool place because we're sitting here listening to 1960s rock and roll. Check out all of this really cool looking memorabilia on the wall. It's just like being in a 1950s diner. It's, it's pretty cool. First we looked at the menu and it, it was, all the names were in English but then all, all the descriptions were in Italian so that was kind of fun. Little store here, there's all kinds of just cool memorabilia hanging out all over the place. We're getting ready to order just a classic bacon cheeseburger and some fries just to see how they do things here over in Italy. So check this place out while we wait for our food.
Well, we just got this burger. It looks pretty good. It's got some good looking American cheese on it, some bacon, some tomatoes, a nice thick patty, some lettuce. Doesn't seem to have any onion on it. That's unfortunate, but we'll go with that. Alright, so let's go ahead and just load her up with some ketchup and mustard. Just as we would in the States. <laughs> well, I guess that's mayonnaise. Yeah, that works too. Alright. Here we go. Oh. oh yeah, this thing is juicy. They do a pretty good burger here. <laughs> oh man. They definitely got the sloppiness right. The beef, it's, it's cooked to a medium well. There's still some pink to it. And it is just, yeah. Everything that you want. Everything that you want from a burger. Definitely. For me, the only thing that's missing is the onions. So sloppy and amazing. Oh, man. Now, I've eaten a lot of burgers in my day. And on a scale of 1 to 10, I'll give this one a 7.5. And, and that's saying something. Because high score burgers are hard to come by. So seven and a half of being in Italy. If if you ca if you factor in that we're in Italy, it's at least a nine and a half. Mm. If you're ever in Florence, you're just missing a little bit of America. <laughs> Come to this place, the 1950 diner, for sure. <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna really say much about the fries. They're they're fries. <laughs> a little bit thicker than McDonald's, but they're just, they're just fries. Nothing really special about them. But we are going to order some dessert here in a minute. There was a certain something on their dessert menu that piqued my, my fat kid interest. <laughs> So we got a peanut butter cheesecake here. Yeah. It looks... It doesn't look all that peanut buttery. But I guess we'll find out when we taste it. Okay. Okay. The, the peanut butter flavor, it's it's light, but wow, that is rich. Like, it it really cuts through with the with the cheesecake flavor. Man, <laughs> it is so loud in here right now. <laughs> Sorry, but I'm going to have to go quiet here. I'm going to have to add some of my own music. Well, one thing's for sure, this cheesecake is pretty good. I'm glad I ordered it. Yeah, definitely worth come checking this place out. Well, if you've enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, 
hit that notification bell. And as always, eat great food.